Hi, I'm Phil Martino from the 680 News Business Center. We're looking ahead to 2019, and here's to hoping it will be a better year for investors than 2018. The TSX closed higher on the last day of trading after what was a difficult year for stocks. Wall Street closed out a turbulent year on a bright note, but still finished 2018 with the worst showing in a decade. Some of the top stories to watch for in 2019, the U.S. and China trade dispute. Will there be a resolution? U.S. stocks rose yesterday amid hopes that the U.S. and China are making progress in resolving their differences over trade. President Donald Trump said in a tweet on the weekend that he'd had a very good call with the Chinese president and added, deal is moving along very well. If made, it will be very comprehensive, covering all subjects, areas and points of dispute. Big progress being made. Another business story to watch for this year is the trade concerns between China and Canada after the arrest of the Huawei's chief financial officer in Vancouver. Will that get resolved? Canadians are heading into 2019 with high debt levels and a battered energy sector, and interest rates are expected to rise. Just how high will they go, and will Canadians be able to handle all this? And then there's a cannabis industry. Will more companies be teaming up in the new year to make marijuana-infused products? Will marijuana stocks stabilize? Will they continue to go up and down? And then there is Brexit. The U.S. ambassador to Britain is casting doubt on whether or not a major bilateral trade deal can be reached if Parliament approves the Brexit proposal from Prime Minister Theresa May. Robert Johnson says it doesn't look like it would be possible to negotiate a quick and massive trade deal under the terms May has reached with the European Union. Johnson says he finds a defeatism in the British attitude toward Brexit that overlooks the many positive developments leaving the EU could bring. And finally, will the global economy slow down? These are all stories we can watch for in 2019. At the 680 Business Center, I'm Phil Martino.